Hey everybody, Joshua Perry here, and I'm back with another power ranking. This time I'm just going through the Big Ten teams, one through 14 of where I think that they should be slotted at this present moment, starting off with number one, the Ohio State Buckeyes. They have cemented this top spot to me based off of their offensive performances. I'm not exactly sure that there are any teams in America, let alone the Big Ten, that can keep up with them in a shootout type of situation. The defense gives me pause, and so this gap is a little bit smaller than other people would imagine because I think that there are some offenses that they'll play in Michigan State and Michigan that could present challenges. But as long as Ohio State's clicking on all cylinders offensively, they're going to have that top spot. Number two is Michigan State for me, and it's going based off of that head-to-head -head they had a couple of weeks ago with the Wolverines. Now, they dropped that game to Purdue, and we've seen Purdue knock off some big teams, so there's a little bit of a question there about some consistency. But when Michigan State's playing at their top end, and you can look back to the game they had over the weekend against Maryland, you feel like this is a team that deserves to be one of the top in America. Michigan is right after them. Margin is super slim. And both of these teams will have an opportunity here at the end of the year to try to go for that top spot and really battle it out because they both still have Ohio State out there. But Michigan to me is a team that really doesn't have an apparent weakness. The only thing that I would say about them is sometimes they leave the door open for opponents when they're in control of games, but largely outside of the Michigan State game, they've been able to close them out and they've shown a lot of guts. That was apparent in their game against Penn State. My number four team is Wisconsin. I think that they could have the best defense in the country right now. I know a lot of people would indicate Georgia, but the way that Wisconsin has played defense has been phenomenal. It's carried them and it's allowed their offense to really come up to par where now Graham Mertz has stacked up some really good performances back to back. The run game has really come into its own. Now Wisconsin is facing Nebraska in their upcoming game. And one thing Nebraska does very well is play defense. So they will be challenged there, but they've got that number four spot. Number five, six, seven, and eight were really difficult for me, but I ended up going Iowa, then Penn State, then Purdue, then Minnesota. Now these are all teams that we've kind of seen the best of the best and the worst of the worst from. Starting with Iowa, at one point they were ranked number two in the nation, then they hit some hard times. You look at Penn State, they were up there in the top five conversation, then they fell on hard times. Purdue, at their heights, have been able to beat teams like Iowa and Michigan State. But at their lows, they've looked a little bit pedestrian at times. And then you've got Minnesota, to where you felt like they were a true competitor over there in the West, but they have blemishes on their schedule against Illinois and against Bowling Green. But it was really tough to slot them out. And then up on the screen, you'll be able to see the rest of my top 14. But there you have it. Those are my power rankings, one through 14 of the Big Ten School.